Hi Leo. Hi, my name's Jackie and I'm here to do a mini bonus reading for the month of June, uh, it's not June, May, for the month of May. And yeah, as I say, this is a mini reading, so I'll just keep it as uh, short as possible. So let's see what we have. So I'm going to pull a couple of oracle cards, so two of we have travel. So we have the travel card. So maybe you're thinking of traveling. And we have great achievement. Okay, so maybe you're traveling to a celebration in some way. So this could be someone getting married. Um, as I say, marriage, engagement, anniversary. Or oh, some uh, maybe a, a child's achievement. Anyway. It's an achievement. So we're traveling towards some sort of achievement. And this could be uh, your own achievements, you know, sort of moving forward in your own area there with an, a great achievement. So let's just pull one from the wisdom. Leo. Clean it up. Okay. That's the message for you, Leo, from the wisdom. Clean it up. So maybe something you need to uh, tie things up a bit. Maybe before you go on this uh, venture or this uh, embark on something. So maybe you need to uh, tidy up the home. Uh, lock up. <laughs> it just popped to mind, sorry. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Make sure everything's done. Secure. And maybe some finishing touches there with that card with your own, uh, an area of your own life, meaning that you work or something to that effect. It's like putting the finishing touches, maybe the finishing touches on something. Okay, Leo. So let's see what the tower has. Yeah, be flexible. Be flexible at the bottom of the deck. So there is a need to be flexible here. In an area of your life so let's take a look what do we have for leo so these cards are huge <laughs> i do like them though oh there you are okay this is your own energy so we've got the knight of wands very spontaneous, feeling very spontaneous at the moment. Is a card that also has foreign connections. So I do feel that you are doing some sort of travel here, especially when this card shows up in your own energy. So something that you're moving towards physically or mentally. All right, so okay, let's just cut the cards. Okay, so your strength. Okay, is your family. This is your strength, Leo. The people that are around you, family members, close friends, uh, people that fulfil you in some way in your life. They make you happy. Uh, this is like the happy ever after card. So this is your strength. It's also being a good mother, father, a secure uh, home or, or someone, uh, strong feelings towards um your family, your grandchildren, you know, things that affect. So slump, strong family connections here in your strength. So if you look at, uh, yeah, something's come along recent, uh, just very recently, something as something's cropped up, something that's uh, been too good to refuse, an offer you cannot refuse, okay, with this Ace of Wands. So we'll see where that's going in a sec. Okay, so in your thoughts, okay, we have the moon card, so uh, don't uh, worry, there's a card of worry, so don't worry about what you're not quite understanding or what you, you don't know yet, okay, okay, we'll see where that's going, 
And then moving forward, we have possible outcome. And um, yeah, possible outcome. What <laughs> else I was looking at there? Possibly the future, near future, near future outcome. We have the Queen of Cups. Okay, so we're in our emotions at the moment, Leo. So fully in your emotions going forward, but be careful with that uh, moon card. You could be dealing with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. I feel more Cancer Pisces here, energy. And also we have Sagittarius energy. Okay, so be careful. Don't sort of overwhelm yourself with something. So you feel overwhelmed or you're going to be feeling really in, in your emotions moving forward. Um, I feel that, that there is a little bit of worry there. There is something on your mind. It's something that you're not um, you're not quite got the facts on or you're not sure about. But we're going to pull some clarifiers, Leo, and see where this is going. So on the Knight of Wands in your current energy, let's see what we have. Knights of Wands. Okay, yeah, so something here. Say something you feel uh, you're in that energy. Um, intuition is on point here with the eye priestess. So something that you're moving forwards, you're moving towards. Um, it's like a little bit of, um, I'd say a little bit of impatience a little bit here as well so you sort of like itching to get going you're itching to get going um you feel you need to be somewhere okay that's how i'm feeling with that card so the ten of cups with the ten of wands something that's quite overwhelming here that's something to do with it could be to do with family or, or your future Looking forward to your future happiness, but something may be, um, might feel a little bit of a burden with that Ten of Wands. It's also a card of, um, it can be a card if you want something done, do it yourself. It could be that energy as well. That's in your strength. So um, maybe you have a lot on your plate or a lot that you need to finish up. Remember, we've got that clean it up card there. So something you need to clean it up. And if you if you know if a job's going to be done well and cleaned up and done the way you want it, then it's best to do it yourself. But uh it's it's not going to be easy. It's, it is going to be a bit of a workload. So this is like a workload, okay. Okay, so recently, so you've got a lot of ones, which doesn't surprise me, Leo. So with that ace of ones, we have the nine of ones. So although it's been hard, whatever you've uh, been through recently, it's been a, a little bit of a, a little bit of a hard time. It tells you not to. It's also a card as well that tells you not to give up. You're nearly there. Um, you're nearly at the finish line in an area of your life. So don't give up, okay, Leo. Uh, and you haven't give up. But there's still something that you're not sure about, especially with that moon card in your focus. Okay, so you're, um, as I say, imagining things maybe that have that 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 haven't happened or are not gonna happen. So don't sort of um, worry unnecessarily. Okay. Okay. Let's see that moon card in your focus. Yeah, this is what you're worried about. Um, just done. Who did I do? Taurus got this as well. You could be dealing maybe with a Taurus as well. But um, yeah, Taurus got this card with the, uh, not with the moon, but they got that card. So you got this with the moon. So there's worries here about what you don't know about um, some sort of pain. Um, as I say, always speak to a professional if, if you're, you know, worrying about any sort of pain. But then um, this is also heartache. So there's some sort of heartache, pain, disappointment, um, this is what you're worried about. I think this is your worry, you know, worrying about losing something that you have in your life. So you're worried about some sort of loss there. 
and with the Queen of Cups. Ooh, repeating cards coming out for these signs. So we have the Three of Coins. Okay, so something um, so something you're being recognised for. So I think you're going to be uh, entering, going into the future. You're going to be in a position where you are going to feel a little bit overwhelmed because i mean this could be even a surprise some sort of in you know this could be going into the summer you know with leo's august end of july birthdays so we could be looking at a surprise um maybe a surprise party there with that achievement and travel card so maybe some sort of surprise is uh and if there is a surprise i've probably ruined it but <laughs> But maybe there's a surprise coming up there in the future. Someone, um, so you're going to have a bit of attention. You're going to be um, receiving attention from people around you. Okay. That's how I felt with that card anyway, Leo. So yeah, great, great stuff. You know, travel, great achievement. Great. And the sun, uh, do you get the sun? They do get the sun, but you've... Um, You've got quite a few wand cards, which tells me you're taking um, some sort of positive action. Although you may feel reluctant to, you are taking some sort of positive action towards something. OK, moving forward. So that's what I have for you, Leo. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll be back for your June readings very soon. So take care. Good luck and I'll see you soon. Bye.